Well, second shots of Pfizer rolled out at schools on Thursday, nearly three months after the first doses were administered. Vaccination got underway at several schools in Taipei, Taichung and Ilan. During this round of school inoculation, Taipei City will conduct tests on 5,800 students to study the effects of the vaccine. After almost three months, students are finally getting their second doses of Pfizer. In Taiwan's capital, the rollout began at Taipei Huaguang Art School. According to studies done overseas, second doses of Pfizer can result in more severe side effects. But students here say they're not worried. It should be fine. I think it feels about the same as getting a regular flu shot. That's how it felt with the first dose. I didn't get any side effects after my first shot, not even a sore arm. I'm not sure what the second shot will be like because I've heard the side effects are stronger. I think that at this stage, getting vaccinated is the better option. My family and I liked going abroad before for fun. Being vaccinated is something of a guarantee. In light of potential side effects, the school plans to hold classes virtually on Friday. When they received their first shots the day after, many students took pandemic leave. Considering that, we decided to go online tomorrow. During the second round of school vaccination, Taipei City and a medical team will conduct a large-scale study on Pfizer's effects on students at four schools. They are Jingguo High School, Chenggong High School, Da'an Vocational High School and Nangang Vocational High School. 5,800 students will undergo electrocardiogram screening to form a database on local youth. According to data from abroad, boys are 10 times more likely to get myocarditis than girls. So we'll carry out a basic screening before the vaccine. We will also carry out large-scale tests to have a complete study. Uh, Second shots will be administered next Wednesday, so the post-test data will be collected Friday morning. We'll know right after it's complete. <laughs> Electrocardiograms are not an invasive test at all. Might as well take part in this project. There's nothing to lose. The study selected schools with a higher proportion of male students. According to the CCC, out of 1.1 million students who got their first vaccine shot, 23 developed myocarditis. Among them, 19 were boys and 4 were girls, indicating a higher incidence in males.